it's time I make a video in which I talk about the fact that as Americans, we're accustomed to much larger refrigerators, appliances in general, but especially refrigerators. So, you know, here's our refrigerator. You know, it's uh, about a little taller than me. You know, we've got the whole freezer. We've got the whole part right here, you know, full of food. And then we've got our pantry, you know, over here, which has all of our dry food. But the main thing I want to say is the fact that we have such a large refrigerator, comparatively speaking to, say, Europe, say, to uh, Japan. And the same thing with our, even our uh, washer and dryer. You know, we have large appliances, and I learned that when I was watching International House Hunters with my wife. You know, when the Americans go to Japan, they go to Europe, and, you know, the, the Americans always want the very large appliances, which, because here in American culture, you have to have it, but over there, you don't have to have it because you can just go downstairs, go to the market, and whatever it is. But here in America, it's a different culture. And I just wanted to acknowledge that, uh, the fact that that's a major cultural difference. If you live out here in America, you're used to having large appliances and keeping all the food in there because we don't really, most of us don't have access to just go down the street and go to the market. Like for me personally, I mean, I'll, I mean, I'm going to at least have to take the car and drive several miles away to get the food. It's not something I'm going to do every day. I think it also speaks to the American culture, uh, the identity even, uh, that we work so many hours all the time. So it's a matter of, we definitely would have time to just go to the store every day and buy food. We have to do it once on the weekend for us and just stock up for the rest of the week and, and hope we have enough because we just don't have time in our schedule because we work uh, so much. So I just wanted to make a video to just briefly talk about that cultural difference uh, because I think for people the rest of the world, they're like, wow, those Americans have their big houses, their big appliances, their big cars. You know, they're like, we have two cars. And it's like, that may sound crazy to the rest of the world. Like, why would you need two cars? We don't have one car. But again, it's like my wife and I work, I work about 20 miles away from where I live. She works about 40 miles away. And you know, we have this house with the, with the mortgage and you know, we work basically to pay that off more than anything. But that's also why as Americans, we're, we're working so hard to try to pay it off early and why I do those, these YouTube videos. You wanna go see mommy? Okay, let's go see mommy. But yeah, leave a comment about that right here in the comments, right here. And yes, this is my daughter. She got all the Dutch and German jeans on because that's what my dad is. And I know I'm more Spanish looking because I am, but I have equal parts Spanish and German for the most part. And she got all those jeans. And if you've seen my wife in other videos, you think, really? Because my wife and I have such similar uh, traits. Oh yeah, what were we talking about? Appliances, yeah, comments, there you go.